Hello guys, this is Sahil. Welcome to Cloud Doctor. In the previous video, we have created the login functionality and in this video, we will set up the session management functionality. So let's start with the video. So here in the account state.js, we will create a new function const get session equals to async return await new promise resolve and reject const user equals to user pool dot get current user if user user dot get session async error session if error reject error else resolve session and here else reject so we will include this here so now in the login.js file we will import get session We have to use use effect here so let me import that also so here what we will do use effect get session dot then session session and after that dot catch error console dot log error so now let us check this functionality okay we have to include empty array here so now let us check the functionality so this is our application I will open the console first of all yeah and we will log in as you can see the login is successful and we are getting the logs over here so now let us verify account state.js line number 67 account state.js line number 67 okay this one So this get session is not working. Yeah, now it is working. You can see we are getting the user session as well. So this is the access token, ID token and everything we are getting. This is the cognitive user session which we are getting from line number 20. So let me check login.js line number 20. Yeah this one so now we are getting the user session our next task is to create a new route so let us do the same in the app.js file we'll create a new route path will be slash admin and for that we need to create an element also admin dashboard dot js let me set the boilerplate
yeah it's done so here in the app.js let me import it import admin dashboard and this will be admin dashboard and uh, what we will do we'll route all of the component with this account state so after browser router account state and we'll wrap everything inside account state because we need to check the user session and we need to you know check uh, routes and all in i think so every pages in the upcoming videos so we need this thing yeah now perfect now in the header component we'll include one more link here so we'll just copy this and we'll paste it here and this will be slash admin and this will be let it be dashboard okay so yeah dashboard is visible so this is admin dashboard this is user dashboard home and this is our login component so that's all for this video i request you to please like the video share the video and subscribe to my youtube channel i will be adding videos frequently to complete this series thank you